Our host sponsor this month is Chef Andre and Oktoberfest, and we're gonna begin the pre-celebration pretty soon, but not before we make a visit once again inside Lugano Swiss Bistro to see what the patrons say. My favorite oh. restaurant. Gotta have my schnitzel fix once in a while. <laughs> now, now, Andre, my favorite though, place in town. He's Swiss. You're German. Yeah. yeah. And so there's some cooperation there. Oh, absolutely. Same home language, and this feels like the homeland right here. So, Detlef, tell me about uh, what you have there. Oh, here, this plate, my absolute favorite. I have to come here every couple of weeks for my schnitzel fix. Jaeger schnitzel, original, with homemade spätzle and red cabbage. It is just fantastic, a little piece of home. I gotta have that. And Cindy, talk about what you have there. I'm being a little adventurous tonight. I'm having the spaghetti with barbecue shrimp. Yeah, it looks delicious, doesn't it? It's, it's good. It's really, it's really good. Now you and Detlef have been coming here a long time, am I right? We've been coming here a long time. Before Mickey was born. Before your daughter was even... Here. Just yes. a gleam in your eye. Exactly. And what what else do you like about? Oh, being I here love. Up? It's like you're. It's like you're on a mini vacation when you come here. I love it here. I love coming here. I love seeing Andre. I love the greeting that you get from Andre and his wife Nargis. Is is just you feel like you're home. Nikki, what do you have to eat there, dear? Oh, I have homemade spetsly. Andre always makes it extra nice for me. So I guess you probably like coming here with your parents because. They know what you like to eat and everything's comfortable. Is that sort of it? Yeah, I love it here. Um, the atmosphere is so great. The people are always laughing and having great conversations. And look at the decor. I mean, this is just really original Swiss chalet. You feel like you're in the Swiss mountains. You've got the cowbells, you've got the wood houses, you've got the alphorns and the music and the ambience is just fantastic. We're on vacation. No better place than having a, a dinner here. It's a small vacation. Yeah, Lugano Swiss Bistro. So we bring a little of Europe to America. We love it here, right? Absolutely. Yeah, no, thanks guys. Thanks well, I, I want to let you eat, so I'll, I'll let you alone and uh, thanks for chatting with us. Good to see you, honey. Okay. Thank Cheers. you. <laughs> What are you working on today? Um, the schnitzels, pork schnitzels. What is a schnitzel um, exactly? Describe it for people who may not know. Okay, this is a pork loin. We cut it in like six ounces and then we pound it. Well, everybody likes the schnitzel? Everybody likes schnitzel. Aisha, tell me about uh, why you like here. Oh, it's so much fun. On Thursday evenings, we'll come, and uh, there's a great band. You know, it's rustic, it's fun, great people, great wine. Yeah, that it's never a hurts. really enjoyable time. You can get up and dance and just let down from the day. It's a really nice thing to do. Okay, and you love fondue, I guess. I love fondue. Yeah. Yes, I do. Yes, I do love fondue. <laughs> yes, I do. <laughs> Sam, why do you like coming to Lugano Swiss Bistro? Well, the food, number one. And number two is the service, and uh, Andre and Nargis, the owners, are very good friends. They've been doing a great job for 15 years, I think, now. And you talked about a little, uh, you're not Bavarian per se, but maybe a, a little bit of connection with well, ancestors. Well, the connection, my uh, heritage is Italian-Swiss, Okay. and so this is a perfect room. This is from Lugano, Italian-Swiss, and Ticino. This is a perfect place. Well, thank you for taking time with us. We appreciate it. My and pleasure. Enjoy the fondue. Thank you. Thank you. Will okay. do. Thank Thanks, All right. guys. Thanks, Hunter. Wonderful. There you have it. Lugano's for lunch or dinner. Don't miss it. <laughs>